Gym Time here in Alabaster has been one of our sponsors of Alabaster Living for quite a while. And I finally took the plunge and started working out here myself about two or three months ago and I am absolutely loving it. The staff here is incredible and we're here today with Ryan Elm and you are the... I'm the fitness manager, uh, director of uh, sports performance here at Gym Time as well. It's a new program we're looking to get started for athletes, training for any sport, uh, doesn't matter. Uh, which one you're doing, whether it's soccer, football, um, or you're just looking to get stronger as far as adults like you're talking mm -hmm. about. Um, so it's something that I'm very passionate about. I'm, I'm really excited to get started here in Alabaster. That's awesome. Give us a little bit of background on you and how long you've been in the fitness industry. Uh, I've been doing training uh, for about 11 years now. Um, I've trained athletes from anywhere from little bitty kids to uh, all the way up to pro athletes. Um, I've, I've got a few like uh, Braxton Barker. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know, a lot of Alabama fans around here probably know Jay Barker back in 92. Yeah. Um, so I trained his son and got him ready for uh, Alabama. I got a girl at uh, LSU right now playing soccer. Um, I got a few that just signed with North Alabama, which just went Division I for mm -hmm. soccer. Um, so I, I got just a range of athletes across the board for different, athletes, or different sports. Yeah. So clearly you've got that background. So bringing this uh, sports performance here to gym time is going to be huge because there is nothing like this anywhere in our area, right? Yeah, there's not anywhere in Alabaster, uh, Calera, um, Montevallo um, that I know of uh, that offers this kind of uh, offering. Um, you know, you go north, you got uh, D1 up in Vestavia. Mm -hmm. A little bit of a travel for people down yeah. this way. Um, you know, parents don't like to travel, especially fighting 65 with all the construction Absolutely. and stuff they got yeah. going on. People don't want to tra travel up there and then have to come back yeah. down to fight that traffic, you know. Right. So it's a great offering here in, the, in this town, especially with Alabaster growing like it is. I mean, they just built the brand new school. They got the new football coach. Uh, the program actually doing very well. They went to the state championship this year. So it's, it's just the area that's untapped that I'm looking to kind of get into in this area. So as far as what will be taking place if they were to bring their athletes here to join um, this sports performance program, what will they be doing? What will you be offering? Uh, it just depends on what they're looking and doing. I mean, some kids, you know, obviously if, if they're little kids or whatever and they want to do speed agility, um, that's really all they're going to focus on. Uh, athletes who want to get stronger, um, you know, will definitely target uh, weights and stuff to do that. But they'll do everything across the board from speed, agility, and quickness to strength as well. Um, kind of what their goals are and what they need. Okay, so that it will be specified to their personal needs yeah. and sport that they're playing, correct? Yeah, yeah, it's all individualized for what, you know, obviously certain athletes, you know, soccer and soccer, would, regardless of boys or girls are going to kind of be the same. Mm -hmm. um, you know, you might just target different things based on their own personal goals. Right. Um, but yeah, football player is going to be different than a soccer player and stuff yeah. like that. So it's all just geared around what sport and their own goals. Okay, so if people are interested in this, which I'm assuming lots will be, how do they contact you guys? Yeah, they can, uh, you know, come into the, uh, into the facility mm -hmm. and uh, talk to me about it. Um, they can call the phone number and, uh, you know, just ask for me uh, and, okay. and I can give them any information uh, that they need to to kind of get in and get started. So. All right, guys, get your little athletes here to gym time. They can help you.